Teachers from Kekula or Samuel M. Kamakau, a Hawaiian medium laboratory charter school in Oahu, Hawaii, are visiting Aotearoa after attending the World Indigenous Peoples Conference on Education, or WIPSI, in Adelaide, Australia. Teachers Kalau Nuola Domingo, Kiane Nakapoe Garcia and Kilipohe Miller are with us now. No mai, hara mai, ki Aotearoa. Welcome. It's a pleasure to have you in the studio today. Aloha. Now, talk to us about the conference first up. You attended WIPSI in Adelaide. What was the experience like for you? This is, you've both been there twice, twice two times, yeah. and you've been there 1,700 times. <laughs> <laughs> what was yes. the experience like for, for you this time in Adelaide? Um, so at the WIPSI conference, we presented uh, Kuhi Komoliola, which is the 22 past years of our school, um, the lessons learned. Why is your school so different? We're a Hawaiian Immersion Public Laboratory Charter School. So the medium of education is through Olalo Hawaii um, up until fifth grade where English is introduced. And what, what did you take away from the conference that will be helpful in, in what, you're, what you're doing in your teaching role? Oh yeah, we took a lot away. There was a lot of lessons learned. Um, one of my favorite uh, things that I took away was from the, uh, the Aboriginal uh, language nests. They put a hundred thousand. If I have the details correct, they put a hundred thousand dollars of funding towards their uh, their the classes geared towards bringing the language into the homes with oh. the parents and the kupuna. Um, and I think that's something that uh, we can definitely strengthen. And this is something that, that's it's part of what you're doing. You're teaching the language. You're revi revitalizing yes, the exactly. Hawaiian language. Yeah. What was it like for you? Um, it was very inspiring to hear from Mahalo to the Garnet people um, in, in the, South, um, the South Plains of Australia for inspiring us. Um, I think it just inspires us more as teachers to keep fighting the fight, to fight for land resource management, uh, management social, social justice um, for our people and the language and the culture. So and it's challenging, right, when other people think they own your land. Yes, <laughs> very challenging. What are some of the takeaways that, that you'll be able to take back with you? Mm -hmm. um, one of the, uh, the Cree nations, they spoke on their, uh, their work on land-based education, which I think we do pretty well in Hawaii. But one of the things they uh, mentioned they do are uh, these cultural camps uh, with the students where they do uh, traditional activities and they do it 13 times across the year. I think that's something that we can implement ourselves. We do it in our own curriculum, but you know, just strengthening that kind of thing. And how do you feel that the, the language and revitalizing the language is helping your people? I think it's bringing healing. Definitely. It's bringing healing, um, oh gosh, not to cry, but um, you know, from generational trauma that's happened with all people, all native peoples, um, I think bringing back the olelo is healing for everybody. Mm -hmm. we, have a, we have a proverb that says, Oka olelo kika ao ka maoli, or our language is the fiber that binds us to our cultural identity. And uh, our cultural identity has been stripped from our people. And exactly like my uh, colleague here, Kilipohe, mentioned, it's healing. Our olelo is healing our people and our land. And we've all gone through this, right? All exactly. indigenous cultures have gone through this and trying to be stronger. But people can learn so much from our cultures. Mm -hmm. What are you? What are you able to? What were you able to take away from, from indigenous cultures that you met? I was able to take away um, the inspiration from our, our youth. Um, we got to watch their presentation of some of our students um, that presented with their other group and what they took away from school with Aloha Aina and Aloha Olelo and Aloha Lahui. Um, they're doing that out in the community. And you're in New Zealand, why? <laughs> to have a look around. Exactly. Yeah, right. yeah, our yeah. cousins. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. We're all cousins. Yes. Hey, look, we certainly appreciate you joining us today. It's a pleasure talking with you today. Kalaoni Ola Keane and Kilipohe, teachers from a Hawaiian Medium Laboratory School in Oahu. Thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your time in Aotearoa. Mahalo. 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 Mahalo.